Right, let's get serious then because obviously yeah, Kanye right. said some more serious stuff for the week still. He did still. Um, <laughs> put the glasses back on you. Yeah. To be honest, yeah. Listeners, viewers, you know what? I've never heard my bro juice like this, you know. <laughs> Man was a broken soul. Broke his spirit. And I was like, yo, bro, it's not that deep, you know. I was deep. I was like, these two, yeah, I think these two need counselling because of it, you know. No, oh, oh. The dude, my man disowned his dad. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know and what? Like, no, and like, deep. Juice is just like, yo, yo. Do you okay, basically now, yeah. Go on, go on. Obviously, from last week, whatever happened, making America great again, hats, loving Donald Trump, whatever. I was saying, yo, I'm looking forward to the interview because mm-hmm. I want to see where his thoughts really are. Mm-hmm. Anyone can tweet 140 characters and not be questioned and not answer up any follow ups or whatever, whatever, whatever. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, okay. The Charlemagne interview, that's what I'm looking forward to, you get me? So I'm watching the Charlemagne interview now, yeah, and I'm, I'm I'm deep in it, you get me? I'm like, okay, I see where his mindset is, and obviously I was worried about, okay, why do you support Donald Trump? Mm-hmm. Obviously I realise now he supports Donald Trump just because it gives him the belief that he can be president one day. Yeah. It's the idea, Karen. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. I mean, to be honest, that's, that's, my, that's my, my real um, gripe. But anyway, the TMZ thing comes out afterwards, and that just kind of confirmed it. Like, man's on there chatting about... You know, it's not even about what he said, because obviously the, he said, ah, oh, slavery's not a choice. No, slavery was a choice. He's like, ah, oh, 400 years, slavery? That sounds like a choice. And it's like... the thing Good impression pres- still. The, they sound like him, yeah. yeah. The presenter... <laughs> the present- uh? Dad? <laughs> oh, yeah. The presenters were like, oh, you know, he's actually trying to be Mr. He's been putting on weight and that. Yeah. <laughs> you got low photo, didn't he? Oh, yeah, no, it's it. <laughs> so it says. But yeah, yeah. So it's just for me, I, I don't even know because, like, I've calmed down a lot now from that day because I was kind of, I was upset still. I was fully upset. Yeah, stress. But it was more like, okay, watching the Charlemagne interview now, yeah, I said, okay, you know what? This guy, Kanye's never really been me, me, me. You get me? Even when it's been stupid and been out there, it's mm. always been like, oh, for the people, trying to do this for the people, trying to do this for the creators. Mm-hmm. When I'm when I'm watching this, the Charlemagne interview, I'm like, yo, you support Donald Trump because it gives you an idea that you could be a president. For what though? What's your policy going to be when you're president? Like, mm-hmm. why do you want to be president? Mm-hmm. You get me? Just so you can be in the White House. That's It's all for the ego. Yeah. And so like, that's, that's what, that's what, that was my main gripe. I was kind of like, oh, in an army with that. Then the whole TMZ thing came out and it's just like, uh, uh, Kanye West doesn't care about black people. You get me? That's what I see it. He doesn't care about black people. He said George Bush doesn't care about black people. Kanye West doesn't care about black people. To say that whole slavery is a choice thing, even just to have the thought and to to go on TMZ and say it, it's just like you don't you don't care about you don't even care to give the extra thought to black people sensitive. Like you know what I mean? Like I, I think there's there's no there's no thought to it. He doesn't, he doesn't think about. He's not thinking about the black community. Yeah, you know what I mean? It's fully. I don't know. I, I, I still do think that there is something um, in terms of with his mental health. There is something there. But it's, it's um, saying it. It's saying, oh, I'm meant to be on seven tablets a day or yeah. something and I'm taking one a week. Yeah. That's what he's saying. That's why week by week he's getting more mm-hmm. erratic because he's, he's, he's not taking the tablets yeah, he's meant yeah. to be taking. But in, Opioids or whatever it is. It's difficult um, because when, we, when, we, when we're talking about like the, some of the comments that he makes and saying that he doesn't care about black people, I think... Kanye's never been someone who's been great with the way he um, delivers a, a message that he's got. He's always been terrible with that, and yeah. he's always mentioned every time he spoke. I've never, I'm, I'm not. Me, the media can't train me. I'm not media trained in that sense. So whenever he speaks, he's never coming as across as any other celebrity. When a celebrity speak, you always hear them speaking, and the, the, it's it kind of you can understand what they're saying, or they're saying in a way that. Yeah, 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 the masses can understand. Kanye just like a stream Kanye of is, ideas. Yeah, it's just it's like it comes out just like that, and it's just like vomit, it's like vomiting out yeah, yeah. in his in his head. Which is a, a constant stream of ideas, and yeah. they don't even like correlate from the last idea. Yeah, so if yeah, when yeah. they say something, then they start talking about something else. Yeah. And it's like when my man um, Van Leef and the, obviously the, the guy in TMZ, the yeah. black guy that like stood up to him, it's like, oh look, free, I'm all for free thought and that, but my free thought is grounded in reality. Mm-hmm, Your free thought. Is is insane. Like mm. you, you, you can have fair enough. You can have free. Like I'm, I'm all for free thought and free thinking. But it has to be based on some sort of reality. You can't just say this, that, and that. But it, there's no way of actually coming to fruition. Like yeah, you can't. I think, 
I think it's 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 and for me, I find it difficult because, as I said, as a, as a Kanye fan, I think there's a, a lot of people who I've seen on on Twitter when I do like kind of sometimes they can't click on some of these tweets mm. and I see some of the messages on there. I've always had this feeling before as well, like when he even when you know when he was bringing out the trainers and he bring out the East Line and people was all like, oh, he's crazy. Then yeah, yeah, yeah. it was kind of like. Why should he? Why should he act a certain way? Like yeah. we all say, okay, then in terms of reality, and he should be, he should do this, he should do that. He, he needs to start thinking like this. Okay, well, open for free thinking, but however, there needs to be a basis on reality. But in a sense, why? Because that's how everyone is. Everyone should be. It's that, and, that, and that's the thing. Sometimes I think what he sometimes makes people think a bit more open mindedly about it is the thinking. Okay, <coughs> yeah. All right, it's true. Why, why but... should why should we have to act a certain way because everyone else does act that way? And I think that sometimes that's what he tries to put out is in terms of with his free thinking and the thoughts that he has, and he's thinking about putting things out into that. I mean, into the universe, yeah. his thoughts. It's like okay, then that's what I'm thinking. So I'm going to put it out there. But the thing with Kanye, yeah, if he's this powerful, is the next Walt Disney, next Steve Jobs. If he's that powerful, which he is, really. Why ain't he out there doing anything? Because I think he's he, in, in in the way that he's done it with um, compared to them. I think that... No, no, I'm not saying compared to them. I'm saying, like, for the black community again, like, what what is Kanye West doing for black people? For the black... He can, I think, I, he's I think, got all these ideas and he wants to do this, wants to do I that, think, but what has he done for black people? He said he wants, well, to, make, he he yeah. wants to make cheap clothes for black people to afford mm. and the Yeezys are expensive as well. Mm. Like, well, to what me, is he did, did you tweet the other day saying that he's, when he brings out the Yeezy stuff officially, it's going to be, ex- uh, what's it called, available, for, uh, well, a reasonable price for everyone mm. and... Because I'm not even in, I'm, I'm, I haven't delved into that um, business world in terms of working out um, how things work. I don't know if he's, he's, he's valued these things at that much to create a revenue enough for him to kind of move forward with it. I know he's a celebrity and everything. And it probably was easy for him to do it at a, at a cheaper price. But then yeah, again, yeah, yeah. if you do it at a cheaper price, then how good's the quality of the stuff? You know, if you know what I mean. If you if I, a celebrity comes out and says, "Oh, buy my um, aftershave. It's like five pound." You're gonna be like, five pound? Mm. Is it even good? Yeah, yeah you know yeah. what I mean. And then so sometimes, but, then, but that's the thing. If if Kanye released some five pound aftershave, it's good. Like it's got uh, Kanye's but, name but, on it. But you got Kanye's name on it. But in terms of the the um, the novelty of it carrying carrying on, how long will it carry on for? Like see, if you think about like Supreme and things like that. But that's the power of Kanye's name. Kanye can release poop the scoop. Mm. I'm not feeling it. You get me. So why can't he release some poop the spray, some poop the <laughs> poop the toilet? No, he, no, he could actually. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm gonna speak, I'm gonna speak to him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like Kanye, Kanye is that powerful? You get me? Yeah, his voice is, is that loud. But again, his influence said, is that that's why I think there's the influence. There's so many influences on on Kanye West as a person. I think that he can do so much. However, based on his mental health, based on his um, his 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 kind of the people that he's got around him in terms of when people say he has got yes men around him, mm. which I do believe is true. I think that he, when he when he's showing texts about John Legend saying, "Oh, this and that" to him. I think that why is it only there's there's certain names that he's he's tweeting and I'm not seeing or I mean texting I'm not seeing the other people who are around him like you you two change you what's it called these people who yeah, are yeah, signed yeah. to him who are or Big Sean saying yo like Big Sean there was a text from Big Sean was there yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, even, your Big boy, Sean. even your boy called him yeah oh yeah. J Cole yeah. <laughs> he, was, he was showing him the bars. These bars. <laughs> <laughs> said, yo, jump on the actually you know you got the smoke pipe to jump on the thing didn't you. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. But, um, we're figuring out. You ready for me to unload? Then nah, I want to. Well, like even mm. it's like Kanye's talking about he wants to build cities. Mm-hmm. It's like I don't think he wants to build cities for people. I think he wants to do it all for his ego. It's all for ego. He wants to be president because it's Kanye. Mm. He doesn't want to be president to help the people. He doesn't want to help any causes. He wants to build cities just to say, "Yo, I'm Kanye West. I've built cities." It's all, especially that whole Solomon interview. As good as the interview it was, and it gave you insight into his like his thinking. It was all me, me, me. That it was is, all there was nothing. See, I agree with that one hundred percent. I agree with that. Um, but then again, when you look at people who want to be legends, when people do want to be legends, are they doing? Are they do they want to be legends for themselves? When people say, remember, you, you want to make a name for yourself, you want to make sure that people remember your name, why are you doing it? Are well, you doing it so people can be like, oh, you know what, that person was this, or are you doing it because people are saying, oh, you. No, but it's you different. I, mean? like, I, you, there's, there, there, I can't articulate myself to kind of put it in a way. Um, I know you say, when, when, it, when, I've, when I've heard people say they want to be a legend, it's like, I want to be a legend in music, which is mm-hmm. fair, fair enough. But when you want to be a legend of helping people... But like, I don't, I don't think he wants to be a legend of just helping people. I, want to be, I think he wants to be an all-time. I think he wants to just be the person whose name 
goes down in history as a person who's done this, done that, done this, done that, and, and break down so many barriers. But if you want to be president, mm. your goal is to help people. That should be your goal. Oh, it's like, look at Beyonce and Jay-Z now, yeah. When they do their charity work, they don't put no PR out. They don't go out there speaking yeah, yeah, about it. True. They're just doing stuff, you get me? Mm-hmm. Like I just, I, Maybe Kanye is doing stuff, but it doesn't seem like he's doing anything. It just seems like it's all... Yeah, that's true. I want to really do, do this to be this, and I want to... Like, I, I don't know. I ain't seen, um, I ain't seen any for it into the I people. just had... I am... Um, a message from told ya he yeah. said to you what did this on your daddy <laughs> <laughs> i'll tell you i'll tell you what okay I, the, re- the reason why i disowned him yes that was that was me stepping that back was from told ya mm-hmm. that was me that was my reason for stepping back from him because he doesn't see for the people anymore the reason, so what, why I step, the, reason? the reason why i stepped back was um which uh, uh, to be honest he does this a lot and you know what I, dad i don't know what's wrong with you man but you, you do this too much he does this thing where as we were saying, he, he, he spurts ideas or spurts what's on in his mind and he just leaves it as that. It's like, mm. I'll enter the room, says something and then walks out and then everyone's like, what, 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 what do you mean? You know yeah. what I mean? And sometimes when he does that, um, it starts to create, it doesn't create a positive um, communication with people. I think it starts to people defending him and then people who are attacking him. And then it's not really a, 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 a decent debate. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. when he's um, said the thing about the um, the four hundred years, that sounds like a choice. Mm. Like because I'm a fan, I thought, what like what are you doing? Mm. Like why are you saying something like that? And then I've sat down and I reflected. And I thought, okay, then it's Kanye. Maybe there's a, there's something behind it as the reason as to why he said it. And I know he, he tweeted after saying. Um, what he, meant. He, he was talking about the, the mentality of, of, of slavery, yeah. and to an extent, no, nah, he had a to point. an extent. He did have a point. I see, I see, I see, I see, I see a point. <laughs> and the thing is, and this is why it's Kanye because sometimes he says stuff, and like, I think he doesn't really care about. Sometimes he cares about the backlash, but sometimes he doesn't. Sometimes he yeah, says yeah. stuff, and it's like, well, I don't give a, like that's what that's what I thought. Yeah, yeah. you know what I mean. But, but then, then again, sometimes some, he's, 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 he's so he's. Out loud now. Yeah, no, you go. go for it. Okay. First of all, I listened to the Charlemagne interview. Yeah. And to be honest, I see his point. I see where mm. he's going. However, Kanye is very what's the word? Needy. Mm. He needs validation. Mm-hmm. He needs love. Mm-hmm. And the validation, he's searching for this validation from the wrong people. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Because he wants all these rich white people to accept him. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> to say, you're at equal. Mm-hmm. But, bro, you're just in a different, you got to make it own way. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That's true. Just like Charlemagne said. Why don't you do things your own? Do it, do it yourself. Why mm. don't you make your own? And then Kanye was like, "Yeah, but to 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 put together a um, to put together a whole collection or a business, a company, you need a hundred million dollars." Now, now realistically, you don't have to go grand scale to start. Just start small. Mm. Mm-hmm. And I know he's got enough money for that. From mm. times buying three hundred acres. Mm. Yeah. Now, to your point, to say. Like, um, he wants to help people. Yes and no. Because Kanye wants the validation of everybody. Mm. He wants everyone to sit there and idolise him. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. In every sense he can do. Mm. Yeah. Now, on the interview, he was saying, oh, I was going past such and such his house and I was looking at all these houses. These houses are whack, man. Da, 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 da. Mm. Yeah? Now... Realistically, like, he's gone out his way to say, okay, I'm going to build these houses, yeah? So, how's that going to work? Is he going to build these houses, have people live on these houses, Mm. pay him rent? Mm. How's that going to work? How's it sustainable? Did I buy the houses, yeah? Or is that just for his people? And why is he doing it? Is he doing it just to say, well, I've helped out this amount of people, you lot should big me up? Mm. Mm. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. And this is the problem. Now, it's 
a case that the Charlemagne interview also showed me that I get what he's trying. I get it. Mm. Yeah, but this is typical Kanye. See now, I don't no, know. Listen, 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 listen to what I'm saying. Listen to what I'm saying. Listen to what I'm saying. With the Charlemagne interview, he sat there and said, "Yeah, they don't want." It's like I'm trying not to like put out no idea of me being crazy, mm. and. You know, when you say something and all the dudes get to a little bit of it and make that the headline. Mm. And that's what he went and did the team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah? yeah. yeah? Mm-hmm. Now, it's a situation that I'm sitting there thinking, yo, if you've just gone and said that how many days ago, why are you giving them clickbait when you go over there? Mm. Well, I know a lot yeah? of people who, I know a lot of people in my life who are like that, though, who don't think before they're speaking. Well, that's what I'm saying. Just, they say something... And then they'll go and you're the sitting there like... But the thing is, but the thing is, you know what, bro? The joke is, yeah, is that if this hasn't shown his mm. impact in the culture, in the world, yeah, mm. then Damn. I don't know what more of a wake-up call he needs. Yeah. yeah because yeah. that one statement is taken out of context. Mm-hmm. You put that as the headline. You put that as the clickbait, clickbait part. Mm. What's that do? It turns every black person against Kanye West. Mm-hmm, that's true. You get me? Now, don't get me wrong, yeah. The memes were funny. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they were. Yeah, yeah, the yeah. memes were yeah. funny. Choice, I've yeah, seen, I've seen some of that going a bit too far, though, still. But, yeah, I didn't make no status. Case, yeah, I had a little say, a little say on, like, on Twitter. I had a little say, but I didn't make no status. I didn't make no post or nothing because, you know what? The way I see it is that I can't sit there and slight another black man like that. Mm. I can't join the mob mm. to knock him down. Because mm. what's that doing? I'm knocking myself down. Mm. You get me? If someone sits there and says to you, Oh, Adrian. What's that? What are these two looking at? But if someone says to you, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that... Um, you look a little bit like Kanye West. What does that mean? That means you're saying I remind you of somebody else, another black man. That's fair. Mm-hmm. Some people say it's racist, but uh, you just get over it after a while. But we're all one man. You get me? Mm-hmm. So when one man's getting knocked, yo, the whole society's got a view on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the situation for me was the fact that, yes, Van spoke and he spoke very clearly. It was pretty... <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, yeah, the way he said it, I was like, yo, fam, did you have that written down before you? Yeah. The thing is, like, did you when have he, when he, when he said that? It, when he said it, I actually thought that there was, there was two different clips, you know. I thought that, yo, <laughs> they, they coming to the interview, he said that, and they had Kanye just looking somewhere, and then they recorded my man saying, yo, because yeah. of the part when he says his name, and it echoes, I thought, yo, yeah. is, 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 yeah. it's fake. Yeah. But yeah. nah, he's, now, what, 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 what you, you listen to his part, like, it yeah, speaks yeah, like yeah, that, yeah, does. it? Yeah, it does. But my point is as well, is that, first of all, this is the first thing. As soon as I saw the TMZ in, in interview, I was like, why has he gone to TMZ? <laughs> That's what I'm I I didn't get it. This why is, is what TMZ? I did. It. Like, the why cheap, in the cheapest of news. Would you go to TMZ? I know. You know, you know why he's gone to them. These people, because he wants to get to get out there. No, you know, I, mean, I don't think it's because he wants to get out there. If you look at the, if you look at the tweets that he's been doing, if you look at what he's been doing recently, and what he said, remember what he said about what his album, his, his album covers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, He's going to the people who he either disliked hated or made his life difficult. Bad, difficult. Oh, so if you look at okay. it, he, okay. the, the, doctor. the person who, the doctor who done his mum's surgery, yeah, you're yeah. going to be the album, the album cover. So yeah. he's trying to say, when he's, when he's talking about, oh, make it all, love. all about love, love, he's going to the people who, yeah. J. Cole, what's it called, the person who, he said, oh, what's it called, I feel like he's just running me down. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's, yeah. he's gone and phoned him. He's um, done, obviously, the, the, the plastic surgery. He's gone to TMZ, the people who were, got, got him running, walking into a lamppost, you know what I mean? Those, he's done, <laughs> he's, he's done all those things. He's gone to the people who, <laughs> People know that Kanye doesn't like to say, you yeah, know what, yeah, yeah. I'm going to breach that barrier. But again, they effed him over no, by only showing, just is showing the, um, the, the, that the one part they said. This is what I'm saying. The TMZ, don't get me wrong, yeah. I can't understand, blame TMZ, though. I understand, but that's TMZ's job. Yeah, I, I, exactly. that's, I, can't, I can't blame that's, him. Yeah, yeah, I can't blame him. Cause and that's <laughs> the reason why I'm sitting there saying, well, it's like, yo, bro, you got to know better. Mm-hmm. It's not a point of, like, people may say, yeah, but. Someone should just stop him. Yeah, I, I do say. Kim should just sit there and say, yeah, Kanye, don't do that. She ain't going to stop him. She she's not going to stop him do anything. She won't want to stop him anyways, because I think that the difficulty with, with Kanye West is because of him being this... 
extrovert. Don't want to call, and I don't want to call him this, this all-powered like machine. But mm. because of because of who he is, people are scared to say to him, "You know what? Don't do this. Don't, don't do, do that. this." Because Kim probably worried if she says that, he might be saying, "Who are you to talk to a god?" You know what I mean? <laughs> Something like that. Yeah, who, yeah. who are you? <laughs> You know what I mean? And um, probably kick his you kick, kick Saint down the stairs or something like that. <laughs> I don't know. How could you just imagine <laughs> so, You so, don't know, you know what I mean? Do I don't you know. I don't know. I, am? I don't know what he's like, what, what yeah, he's like yeah, around, yeah. you know what I mean? But from from hearing about how he when it comes to um going back to how he is with his music and how he's like kind of a perfectionist and when he used to tell the man, yo, yo, when we go on to do um, what's it called, this album, every man's wearing suits in the studio. Like mm. he's quite you can see he's quite a demanding person. So yeah, yeah, yeah. if someone yeah. says to him, Yo, what you're doing is wrong, more than likely he ain't gonna take that quite like, that's the point, thing. right? This is the thing. It's like I look at it and say, Well, he says, mm. yeah, that even on the sh- this is the thing on the Charlemagne interview, he shows how how many people he feels has hurt him. Mm. Mm. He said Obama hurt him, mm. hurt his feelings. He said Jay hurt his feelings. Mm. Mm. You hush. Now, um, the fact is that shows that he's not like this impenetrable force. Oh yeah, it's never, no, it's never, so, it's never, it's never so, 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 so when people criticize him, yeah. Mm. It hurts him. Now, if that's the case, you got to be mindful for what you say. You got to be mindful for how you act. Mm. You get me? Mm. Because the yeah, fact is, true. yeah. Because the fact is, yeah. If you're getting hurt, mm. yeah, by someone saying something, then you got to watch what you say. Yeah, yeah. I hear that hundred percent. I mean, because at the end of the day, it's just naive to think he. he it's like this is the reason why sometimes he's just got this self-centered attitude where it's like, yo, everything's about me. I'm gonna come out. I can say what I want. No one can't say nothing back yeah. to me. Mm. And if you do, oh, that hurt my feelings. Shut up, man. Mm. You know, it's, it's idealistic as well, man. Yeah, realistic. He's not living in the real world. Oh well, no, I don't. I don't think not. he is. And I think that that's down to, as, as, as someone said before, the, the people have given it, put him on the pedestal to the for him to. To stop seeing, I don't know, you know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I, I, I kind of think it's something to do with how he's coping from the um, the breakdown, because you kind of it, it sounds like that's breakthrough. how. It, oh yeah, it causes a breakthrough. Even that, it's, it sounds like how he's managed to cope from having that breakdown is putting a positive spin on everything. Yeah, mm-hmm. everything, everything's yeah, positive yeah, yeah. now. Donald Trump's positive, kind of like everyone is positive. Mm. The doctor that friggin like, killed his mum is positive now. But so why that? But the that, doctor didn't. It wasn't that. It wasn't yeah, 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 yeah. But I mean, mm. it it wasn't his fault. But you know, yeah. but like, yeah, it's like that's it's an unrealistic way of thinking, and that's something that's is that's a mental issue. Like you can't put a positive spin on everything. I just sit but, there. I just sat there and thought to myself, look here. This guy has got the whole of the black community turned against him. Don't get me wrong, yeah. You had the you had the woke folk, mm-hmm. the woke folk that were like, no, no, no. But you gotta listen. You got about free thought. Da, 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 da. People have got to understand, yeah. In the society we live in, yeah, there is order. Without order, there is chaos. Mm-hmm. If everyone, if every single person is free thinking, nothing's gonna get done. Oh, that's true. Because there is no uniform to follow. Mm-hmm. You get me? Don't get me wrong. Yeah, everyone should have the ability to express themselves freely. However, it's a case that if I go to work and I just go to my job, my boss and say, "Yo, I'm free thinking. I'm thinking freely, so I ain't do what you say." Mm-hmm. How's the school supposed to work? True. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, I it's like yeah, I it's like if I, if I if I come up to you and say, "Yo, I'm a teacher, but this is what the um, the curriculum's supposed to be doing." Yeah, but I'm a free thinker, so I'll teach him what I want. I'll, I'll teach him. <laughs> I'll teach him. I'll teach him handstands. Yeah, 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 for the lesson, and then that'll get through. No, it won't because that's not what the world is asking mm-hmm, for. Mm-hmm. You get me? Without without order, there is chaos. Mm-hmm. So all these people that are sitting there saying, "Ah, oh, you know, understand the freak." I understand free thinking. Yeah. However, we have a society to run with. So so it's idealistic. It's so, not realistic. So then it's would nice. You, would you, would you say that in a world that has that needs structure, a world that has structure, do we need people like Kanye West? Of course we do. We do need people like Kanye because it, we need people that will create change for the yeah, better. Yeah. <laughs> we, we need. We do, yeah. need we do. You know what I'm saying? What I'm saying is, yeah, I think we need people we like need Kanye people West like Kanye. away from politics <laughs> and serious stuff. Yes, yes. Yeah, like, yeah. Kanye is need... great doing what he's doing. He doesn't need to be in politics and serious what? issues. Because like the thing is, yeah, this is what I'm saying. This is this in terms of the, the Charlemagne interview. It hit a big point because when it came to um, him going into fashion, mm. I understand what you're saying. 
People will sit there and say, yo, you're a recording artist. You stay there. Mm. That's your position you play. Mm-hmm. Don't, 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 don't step out of that barrier. Yeah, no, yeah. no, 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 you're not supposed to go out yeah. there. No, 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 yeah. no. We're, we're the gatekeepers, so mm. you stay there because that's that's where your kind stay, mm-hmm. yeah? yeah? You don't you don't step on our side of the road. Mm-hmm. You get me? Now, I get that. 100%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I back him on that because at the end of the day, for, for, for Nike to sit there and say to him, yo, you can, we'll make the money, but you don't get paid, you don't yeah, get royalties, yeah, yeah. we'll donate it to a charity. How in the world is that helping him? Mm-hmm. How, why are you going to work for someone, such a big company, for free? It don't make sense. Mm-hmm. Now, all that stuff in terms of the fashion, I get it. In yep. terms of the idealist, the, I, the idol people that he looks up to, all these rich white men, it kind of, I'm kind of lost in that source because I'm sitting there thinking, yo, bro, these people... Don't want to know you, G. Mm. You get me? Mm. A few of them may, 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 may run with you, but the majority of them, they ain't going to want to know about no Kanye West because you're not in those circles, bro. You're not, you're not, you're not, they don't want you, they don't want you on those circles. So well, the fact is you've got to make your own, make your own way, like Charlemagne was saying. They want him in them circles, but just, you know, good boy. Like you were saying, good boy, just, yeah, you know, yeah, do, yeah. do as we say, yeah. you can't. yeah. But, it's uh, like it's like yeah 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 you can come to the house but you can't sit at, you can't sit at the same seat as me yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. you sit on the kids seat yeah, yeah, yeah. get me now that I get a hundred percent back him because it's hundred percent sense mm-hmm. and it's an idea we have in society mm-hmm. yeah but you've got to understand yo Kanye you've got to be mindful how you speak man because that one statement fam. Mm. Mm. Yeah, slave, yeah, no. I know that one of the biggest hot top slave um, the top tweets this week is if slave was a choice yeah yeah of course yeah, yeah I mean what do you like think of the, um, the album cover like with the um, doctor I don't think he's gonna do it he's yeah. not gonna do it the doctor, nah yeah the, he got the a cease doctor, and desist the doc- yeah it's a cease and but um, the, the, I think it's it's a bit I understand his idea yeah I understand it but completely. it's a bit distasteful so it, and yeah that's the word distasteful just because I think to myself, yo, bro, at the end of the day, uh, you don't need to bring that energy to the blessing that you're going to have in your music. Mm-hmm. You don't want to start it with... An... Some people will see it as negative. To Kanye's like, now, nah, but I'm using it as love. Yes, but other people will see it as negative. You don't want that to, to say, yo, that's going to set the tone. Mm. You get me? Bear people, bear people go like, yo, who's this face? And then they search it up. Yo, it's one who kills the man. Yeah, yeah, man yeah. Yo, that's deep, man. That's bad. But see, that is, see, sometimes I sit there and I think, I'm saying sit, sit there and think I'm doing it now, where it's like, because no one's, you know when no, one, no one's done something, it seems so weird to you and it's, it's, it's just a madness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like that's what happens so much with Kanye. He does things, it's like, I can't believe he's done that. I yeah. can't believe it because it's never been done before and then it be, like, becomes a norm. Oh. Like, you see, like, um... For instance, um, you, see, you see the scoop de poop. Obviously, that that's not shock to me now because mm. I've heard people do it. When Young Thug first came out, I thought, "What the hell is this guy? Mm. This, uh, I thought this yeah. is some weird thing." And now look how many people are, and it's just the norm now. Mm. People are listening to MCs who we don't even know what the hell they're saying. We're just like, "Yo, this tune, this, <laughs> this tune's all right." You know, my mum yeah, could be yeah, saying, yeah. "Oh, I shagged my mom last night," <laughs> and we don't even know what they're saying. We're just like, "Yo, you hear the yo, you hear the beat then?" <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like bypass and, and the lyrics, you know? Because 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 um, it becomes <laughs> It becomes a norm. Something has to happen it. first before it becomes a norm. And I see it sometimes when Kanye does things, it's like, it's so not, it's not, because it's not the norm, we're so shocked about it. And then it becomes normal. That's why sometimes people say, oh, Kanye is ahead of his time. Like, even with 808 Heart, uh, uh, what's it called? Yeah. That, when we first said that, well, when I first said that, I was like, so that's, mm. that's the thing. And then it became a norm. So it was well, like Kanye usually challenges the norm within music or yeah, within yeah. art, within design. I don't need him talking about politics. No, and, I, 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 mean. I agree that he shouldn't be in politics. But again, this is this is what Donald Trump has done. If anything, yeah. Yeah. but yeah. him being in in office has made but, people think, yo, but, anyone could, anyone could be this. But you've got to understand, Donald Trump has a little bit of history in politics you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah he has he has been a congressman for a while and he has been in politics since like the late 80s you know mm. so you've got to even though <laughs> his, his twitter feed just top bants it's just that he has got a tiny bit of like you know backing it's just that the majority of the stuff that he comes out is just an idiot yeah you know what to kind of move on a little bit you know what kind of bugs me about all of this like 
all of this. What? We're having... OK, obviously, Kanye sparked all this discussion and that now. Yeah, Even the whole TMD thing. It was a, a good discussion between Van and um, Kanye and that. Yeah. Why, why are black people... Have, why are we always having these conversations, like, in public? Like, we're having all these, like... We're dropping so many gems on Twitter. You know what I mean? So many conversations about... I don't know, it just seems like... It feels like we're the only culture that's working out our problems in public. Mm, I hear that. You know what I mean? Do you know why? why? <laughs> because other... How can I put it? Because other races, mm. they've got their their infrastructure already set. Mm. You know what I mean? It's like Asian culture. Mm. Yeah. Everything's done in-house. In house, yes. yeah, like yo, the family's doing this, yeah. I know, I know, I know, everything's in house, that's why they're running, yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, I think even white culture sometimes, <laughs> sometimes white culture don't even talk about it, <laughs> they just try to yeah, like, yeah, they act yeah, like yeah. it's not happening, yeah, yeah, true. No, no, we just ignore that, yeah, we yeah, don't yeah, talk yeah, to yeah, him, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we don't talk to that uncle, it's okay, <laughs> yeah, yeah. just ignore it, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean, but because black people. The white they've got to get it out. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean, and I think that that's it's it's difficult, man. I think that because different cultures do things in different ways. It's like I read the other day that um, the highest, I think, the highest depression um, percentage in the world was was Indian women. Yeah. Yeah. Now, mm-hmm. I ain't gonna comment on anything of that because. Yo, it's out of my league, you get me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you got to look at the culture that promotes that. Yeah. you got to look at the norms, the social norms in that culture that is allowing that to happen. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 So, realistically, it's like, it's with black people talking about everything on Twitter and that and this and that, it's because I think that, one, we are... We spread out over the, all over the world, you know, mm. And people might say, yeah, but that's not a big deal. So white people, yeah, but we are putting, we, we are in places that we were not born. Mm. But I mean, like, even like, it was like that conversation was on TMZ. Exactly. Well, it's always on like white platforms, you know what I mean? Yes. And I, I'm not even trying to make it a race issue, but it's a, it's a real thing. Like, we're what having. Wasn't that on BT? Eh? Why wasn't that on even, BT? But even, even like, for real, like, why wasn't that on BT? B- T- you get me? Why? None of them big black stars even F with, F with that, to be honest. But to be real. When was the last time but you seen Jay-Z is, do something with BET? True. No, nah, I mean, but, but why, why not? But I mean, like, look at, look at, like, everyone's woke on Twitter. Being woke on Twitter does nothing. Yeah, <laughs> you know what I mean? We need somewhere where we can actually, like, a black house of commons. You know what I mean? Where we can get, bla- we can get together. But you, black to- <laughs> but you can't. But you can't. You know why? Someone needs to. You know why? Kanye's worth if, Jay-Z's... You know, if, someone needs to just... If we had, like, that, for example... Say a black cat has comments, yeah? There'd be more divide. Yeah, yeah of course. Why? Why, why, why so? Because, you, you, you... because you're saying, OK, these are our problems. We're going to segregate ourselves away from the rest of the world. Mm-hmm. We'll talk about our problems here. This is our problem. However, there might be, like... 1500 white guys that might say or white people that might say yo have you thought of it like this and they may give you a different spin on it not to like knock down your point but to say to say yo there's different things to add to it yeah you but get me then that's when you have your black representatives to speak at the <laughs> <laughs> to speak what's that what's it called the g7 or something i don't know where yeah, yeah, all yeah, the yeah, united yeah, nations yeah, yeah. get together I and just i don't know man i just thought should, needs it be, to be a bit. should it be a racist draft there as well huh? should it be a racial draft there as well what's, what's a racial draft you don't know a racial draft is? Nah, it rings a bell what's it, what is it again it's so like we get to choose who get you. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah the racial <laughs> <laughs> Even though yo, I, I hate all that talk, you know, I'm gonna swap Kanye West for it. It's like, <laughs> no. Like Kanye West is a is a black man with ideas and everyone should be listened to and that kind of stuff. But... At the end of the day, the fact is that Kanye is very powerful, regardless of what people may say. It's a case that this one statement has been able to throw on all over social media. Mm. And that shows you the power. Mm-hmm. So it's just a case that when something positive is said, make sure you share it with the same energy. Mm, I hear that still. You hear that? Yeah, because man. at the end of the day, what Ka- the core of what Kanye is coming out with, yo, he's right because, yo, 
slavery has happened, but we are the, like obviously the generations down. But you can't keep that same mentality. Mm -hmm. We've got to free ourselves. You've got to use education. You've got to use empowerment. And the fact is that if you are able to break free of those chains, you're not you're not chained up no more. You are free. You've got to realise mm -hmm. anything is possible. You've just got to find a way to do it. You know what I mean? If you've got to link arms with another man to work at it to do it, you've got to do it. Yeah. Just don't, don't sit there and think you're going to be held down for the rest of your life because you're not. Because at the end of the day, you know what? You know, I get people saying to me, ah... Oh, I get people saying to me, oh, are you negative, man? I'm not negative. Born you negative. Because the fact is... You that know, is a double there... negative. <laughs> Shush you. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, you know what it is? It's like, if I know outside that door is a lion and he's hungry, mm. yeah, and I have my child in here, why am I going to sit there and just let her walk out on her own she don't know? Why am I not going to arm her with a shotgun right, to shoot that lion? Not that I'm going to promote animal cruelty, but you get my point. You got, the, you got it there, TMZ. <laughs> Black man teaches dogs to shoot lions. But, <laughs> but I've got to give her the tools ready to prepare her for the knockback so that she can say, yeah, yeah, I know it's going to happen, but I know I can fight back from it. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, you get yeah. me? All these people saying, oh, you're negative, you're this, you're that. I'm not negative understand that i'm 100 percent positive if this isn't a man about unity and love it's me because yo everyone's everyone and i love everyone but i've got to give the tools so that's it like gunshot i've got to give him the tools that, yeah that, that was just his daughter outside <laughs> 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 got the line with one shot you know <laughs> madness <laughs> lying dopey in it <laughs> But right. you gotta have the should, tools, man, so they're ready for the world they're going into. Alright, well, should, we should we talk about some music? We'll talk about music. Yeah. Enough of Mr. West. Yeah, man. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so, so, <laughs> the line yeah. wasn't dead still, bro. Started, started dancing. Me, <laughs> it's, it's our move. <laughs> Actually, you know, speaking of lion, that's why I kind of laughed. Do you see that video with the man getting dragged up by the lion? Oh, <laughs> no, 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 no. Do you know what? I stayed away from it on purpose, you know, because yeah. I was nah, like, I in the... Part of me, sometimes when I see certain videos, it's like, you know what, certain WhatsApp groups, I'm just like, it's part of me to think, oh, why are you sending me these videos, these mashup videos? I got this video, I didn't even watch it. All I saw was the caption under it. Um... Someone sent me about, ah, oh, this woman getting her head chopped off. Why are you sending me this? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that. Just really. don't send me this rubbish. Stop. No, but this basically it's someone's recording the lion <laughs> in the cage or whatever. Yeah. Then one man now, uh, yeah, and also, I think he's a dad or something. You know, he like, work, doesn't he work there? I don't know. Man's cruising, you know. Yeah. And, and, and you know, like the little dad stroll, just, yeah, just cruising, kick some dude on the floor. <laughs> then man realizes he looks at the lion, tries to run. He does and, not try and, to run. You know, you, know, you, know, you know, when like the um, you know, when you cross the road and then the lights change and you're, like, yes. you have to do yeah. that little, yeah. that little, <laughs> that little a scooter across the road just yeah. so that the car don't. Like beat their horn and stuff. Yeah. That's what he's trying to do out the cage. Yeah. Like that like they said a lion can't isn't running on, on, on four legs. Like oh you can't dust God. him and catch him. What, what was he doing in the cage? I don't oh. I, I think he I think what he was doing is checking the lion's stool because I think that's I don't know someone probably can um, educate me on what 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 sometimes they do, but I know that sometimes when they when to check the lion's stool it might check what's going on with them. <laughs> See, see up there? Visionary. Is this it? Visionary. Yeah, yeah, that one, visionary. Because yeah, yeah. you see, he goes all up to it and like looks at it kind of. So I don't know if he's checking like the. the... Low it! <laughs> you yeah. see the little run? You see low the, the little. The, little whoop, the lights have changed. Lights low are amber. It. Oh, low it! <laughs> yeah, I'm You should hear the woman oh. shout. Oh! Yeah! I was going to play this oh. though, but it's kind of. It's kind of. It's kind of. We can do is Shoot it! Oh my god! Shoot shape. it! <laughs> Yo! Uh -uh. Nah. <laughs> shoot. Nah. Shoot. Shoot. Nah, 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 nah. Then the line gets up and start. Shoot. Shoot. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's, it's deep, so it's deep. Nah, it's deep, so it's deep. It's deep, man. Yo. Yo. The cry move the cries, man. <laughs> Yo. Yeah, it's deep, so it's deep, man. It's deep. Yo. What? Yeah, Yo. I just... <laughs> I, 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 I said, I, you know I think he works there. You know there. what? You know what? <laughs> I think he works there. My man's probably the corner. Not line. anymore. <laughs> my, my, man, <laughs> my man was probably calling the nut line. Hella names, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Little yig. <laughs> yeah, big pussy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Yo, the lion just turned around and grabbed up his cloth. 
the thing is, I know that he, I know his hand was on the door, you know. After I knew his yeah, door, I yeah. made it. <laughs> Guess again. <laughs> Dragged like, him back, you know. It's like, uh, yeah, no, nigga. <laughs> I got you. I can't even laugh to it. Like, it, it looks. It look, now, do we know if it's dead? Oh, it's uh, it looks so dead. bad. Because I said shoot it. I don't know if it might, but he was ripping me. I don't know if he was there. Yo, he was taking chunks out his back. Being true still. Play music. <laughs> Yo, what's good, what's good, what's good? It's the Hard Food Podcast. Back again. My name is Juice English. Jackson King. And make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel. Click these videos that might be popping up. Press Probably that button that should be down here. Somewhere. And just enjoy what you're listening to and watching. Get involved, comment, say what you want. I don't take it to heart. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's all good to me. But yeah, subscribe, follow, press the videos wherever they are, and enjoy. Bless up. Big up.